Hello, the next uh, tool I want to talk about is the open feature. It's the next one in line just below the uh, new from template. So if we go to the file menu, and here we go, open. Now there's three different ways that you can open a project or a file. Right here, you can just click right here. You can also see there's a hotkey. If you hold the control button down on the keyboard and press O on the keyboard, that'll open the document. Or my preferred way is to just click this icon right here. That's the open. If we click the open, we'll have a little dialog box open up, and then we can go and find where our embroidery files are using the navigation inside this window. And you scroll until you find what it is you're looking for. By default, Bernina wants to open an art file. And that makes sense because when we use the open feature, we want to open an existing uh, project file that we can edit, change, make additions to, use components from maybe to uh, design something else. We would not really be using the open feature to design to open something like an EXP file or a DST or a PES, something that's compressed and basically flattened. When we open an art file and it's a grade A, we, we have total control. We can open uh, that file and change the density, the pull compensation, rescale, resize the design, just about any way that you want. When you open up something you've downloaded from the internet, not so much. We would be using for that maybe the insert file feature, which we'll get to later. So for now, we're going to use the open feature to open art files. Now you can click here and see that you can open just, you can try to open just about anything else, and you can. You can actually go to all files, and this box will let you try to open things that aren't even like okay bunko dice and it's gonna say that's an invalid file type or unknown file type that's because it's a graphic we're not using the open feature to open anything except embroidery projects specifically art with an art extension an ART file so then I would want to go back to save yourself any confusion or to save yourself from accidentally trying to open the right, wrong types of files if we do make sure that this is selected all Bernina embroidery software designs art if we make sure that one's selected as we're cruising through this dialog box this visual navigation we're only gonna really see files that you can open and play with okay like okay let's see this digitized 3d star that's an art file let me click that and there it is. See, I can click this guy. He's uh, all grouped together. Maybe I can ungroup him. And then I can see you can select the individual components. I can right click. I could change that to a special satin. I could do all kinds of things. I could change it to a step stitch. It's going to look completely different. You can, when you open art files, you can make all of these edits. When you're opening things like a EXP file or a PES, or there are a lot of other, and you'll see a lot of other types of files that you can open. You're not going to be able to make these uh, scaling changes. They have to be art files. Okay, so remember that when we're using the open feature, file open or control O, or we're using the little icon there, open art files. Save yourself a lot of trouble. Thank you.